What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Chuck McGruff, coming back again with another series, man. Another college series at that. Another NCAA dynasty we're going to build. But this time, we're going around to the basketball world, man. How many of you guys can recall the NCAA basketball 10 when we had college basketball games, man? It's been a while, man. I, I play NBA 2K19. And all the old 2Ks, you know, where we were, you know, get the college team mods. But you only have 32 slots to put 32 teams, man. Only 32 slots for 32 teams. But, you know, it kind of misses out on the tournament, you know, everything else after that. And they still have the draft in the NBA 2K. So you're not really recruiting kids like you want to. So after one season, it's really dead. So what, what that made me do was dust off this old NCAA basketball team let's go back into some little recruiting and building some powerhouses man and try to get this thing rolling getting a dynasty built here man so you can see right now we are doing this dynasty with the Texas Southern Tigers how many of you guys remember the Texas Southern Tigers man I played never played I meant a dynasty with the Texas Southern Tigers most of the teams I played with be from the East Coast man I was able to play with a you know a couple powerhouses in my years and take them to the national championships but never did I rebuild the school and got them to the promised land so man what I'm gonna do here is take these Texas Southern Tigers from Houston Texas Build them up in the Southwest Athletic Conference. Get us respected there. And hopefully we get an invite to the Big 12, man. So we can face off with teams like Texas, uh, Kansas, Jayhawks with Bill Self and them who's always year in, year out, very competitive, man. And we're going to try to make Chuck McGruff, one of the best coaches in NCAA basketball and NCAA football. If you guys that's watching the other series over there in the Furman side, we getting it, baby. So we're going to get this one the same way. I got the sliders customized to my liking. It's not easy. It's not, not totally hard. We are going to win some games, but we're going to lose the games that we're supposed to lose. Not the games that we're not supposed to lose most of the time, unless it's a human error for myself and not making those smart passes or whatever. But anything else on top of that, we should be winning games, maybe get an upset here or there, you know, get invited. Our goal for this year is to try to get this team into the tournament, even if we got to take the 16 C somewhere, man. Try to win our conference tournament. I'm not sure about the conference championship the regular season you know but we maybe can make some um fire you know get a find a spark or something at the end of the season and you know muscle our way into the tournament because they got us ranked at the lowest team in our conference man i took one of the worst teams with a, like a rpi of 320 something man you know that's extremely low so man what we trying to do is get some recruiting going get some good stuff get some kids in here man our roster is full up with a couple of seniors, man. I believe we're going to be able to sign 10 guys this year. That's crazy. I never, I was going through the teams on the list to choose from, and I was like, holy crap, this might be a good, interesting rebuild here. They're losing 10 seniors their first year, so Coach McGruff may will be able to fill 10 spots with players of his choosing, man. And we're going to go through the recruiting. I'm kind of rusty at the recruiting and stuff, but we're going to get it done, man. We're going to get back used to this thing, and I'm going to get in. But the gameplay, I don't think I lost too much, man. We're going to see a lot of movement with the ball. We're going to run an up-tempo game. We're going to be making, you know, doing some post moves. But our job is to get the ball down court, and we want to put a shot up in at least the first 10 to 15 seconds. We don't even want to use the shot clock. We want to make this thing exciting and fly up and down the court so let's get into what like our um recruiting well we're gonna go to the school overview first so you can see Digo texas southern houston texas location the conference we in the southwest athletic conference team prestige not that bad three stars because you know um texas southern has some basketball history school pride too because you know uh nobody believes that you know they have a big big chance of winning any championships in in the national on a national level but conference titles man we we have a few nine but national titles none man and that's our arena the health and pe arena it was built in 1989 only 8100 seats in this arena i mean we're gonna try to you know build this school up man pack this stadium out man and get respected out here so you see how uh, we have generated names for this roster 
No no updated rosters on the Xbox 360, man. I've been looking around, man, before I started this series and wish I could have found some, but none. None are there, only for the PS3 versions. So what we got here is the center, man, Justin Royal, 64 overall. Like I said, we're not that great, and I kind of like this because we're going to have only two players we can play with, a low post, L. Gilliam, whatever his name, Leon. He's a complete post, so he can... You know, get us some bastards around the rim, but he's only he's a senior. Then we got Kenneth Godfrey here. He a senior also, a six six point guard, pretty big kid. Pass the score, so we're gonna lean on these two guys to get our offense started, and everybody else, you know, will help us out a lot also. So what we gonna do, man? They got my guy Godfrey at the small forward. I thought he would have been the point guard, but he's gonna be the small forward since he's six six, and we're gonna lead these guys down here. So we gonna might we might. We might run our offense through Godfrey, man. He might be our primary ball handler. That's what I'm thinking. We should go with that one. So we're going to have more of a, a point forward type player. He's a passer scorer, so it don't hurt to keep the ball in his hands a lot. And maybe he can initiate the offense. And we're going to push it, man. We're going to push it. So as you can see, the bench is kind of weak. We got a few seniors and all that type of stuff. We're going to lose a lot of players. We got a few seniors. We're not going to lose a lot of players. But I mean, we only got eight players on the roster, so it's going to be kind of complicated. So, you know, when we're dealing with, you know, fatigue and everything, players are going to be tired in and out, interchanging. It's going to be kind of interesting to see how this team fares, man. And also, we want to see the coach statistics. As you boys know, it's your boy Coach McGruff up here. I took, I put the baldy on Coach McGruff in a suit, man. I want to, you know, give him more of a official look. Like he used to be in here in, uh, in the NCAA basketball world. So we're going to get in there, baby. And let's check our recruiting out here, man. It's just a little preview of the Dynasty, man. And we're going to get into it, man. The next video is going to be our first game. So we're going to look at our targets and what we already have. So we already have a few targets on the board. We're going to go to each position. So our targets... What we have so far, we have a center, Mike Soto, man, 6'8", 255 power post from Berkeley, California. Um, he, he's interested in us, highest, and we're going to go through every couple weeks. We're going to scout. We think we already put some points there to scout him and everything. We need, we need a center to come in and help off the bench. We're going to have to, a lot of freshmen going to get opportunity to play next year one thing i know for sure and the power forward we're losing our power forward center so we're going to try to recruit two kids man we got one for dallas texas and another for fullerton california and man they want immediate playing time complete post so complete post and power post i like to have a complete post at the four position because we got to be able to pull it out for the mid range and shoot a couple shots jump shots when we have to and also small forward man i'm trying to fill up on a bunch of small forwards it's because, man, there's a lot of length, a lot of players that like the wing players, man. You can slide a small forward at 6'5 to shooting guard if you got to. And it also helps out a lot of three-star kids. And shooting guard, we got a kid from North Carolina represent. And Bob Pope passed the score, man, 6'1", 6'3". These guys can play as a point guard if they have to. And I don't believe we have any point guards. Let me check and see if any point guards are even interested in us. Only one, Grant Marshall. We're going to put him on our list also. Three-star from Logan, Utah, man. We're, trying to get, we're getting kids from all over. Well, we're not at his top school, but we're going to try to get into it and see if we can get him in here. Because that's the only point guard, point guard that is interesting us very highly. We don't need one immediately, but it will never hurt to have an extra point guard, man. So we're going to lean towards those other positions a little more. Maybe we can just see if we got anyone interested in us high. But I don't think so. So we good here, man. Let's see if we can go through a, something else. Okay, the coaching. Report card, we done did that. NCAA. Trophy room. All right, so man. We ready, baby. I believe we're ready to take, you know, take this thing to the next level. And that'll be our first game. And I'm ready to get into this dynasty as much as you guys are, man. To upload for these videos, you know, it's going to be... I'm going to try to upload a couple of videos a week. 
for this dynasty along with you know continue to upload i know we've seen a a long a lot of you know multiple uploads on those firming videos it may slow down a little bit you know because we you know we're going to be jumping in between just like the euro league I'm, i got a couple more videos i want to upload for those that one too and you know and we're going to try to you know keep it to you know satisfy everybody man just give it like everybody a couple uploads a week and man just leave some comments let us know how you feel about the dynasty that we got going on already the new ones and all this other type of stuff man and we're gonna get to it man like i always say bro a hundred i shoot you know and holla at your boy don't forget to hit that subscribe button that like button that notification bell and man let's get it going we're gonna start dropping